Hey guys, I hope you're all well and welcome to the first episode of our Sacrosanct Studio Diary in 2021. As you may or may not know, the drums you heard on the previous record Necropolis were sampled and programmed drums. This time we want to go a different route and we want to record live drums. And as I'm the drummer of the band, it's my job to record the drums. I'm sitting here in my little home studio where I set up the drums with all the mics that I have. It's in the other room right now, but I will show you that in a second. And um, I'm currently working on prepping the drum set and working on the notations for the tracks that are already written so that I can prepare myself to record the first tracks. As you know, the year 2020 pretty much sucked for all of us and um, we only had the opportunity to play two shows in total last year, which happened in January. We were very lucky to have those two shows before all went down, but it gave us uh, more time to write the latest album. Now, I don't want to give away too much just yet, but the thing that I can already promise you is that the new record will be faster, heavier and more proggy than the last one. So stay tuned and watch out for new episodes. And now, let's go to the drums. Alright, here we have the drum set that we'll be using to track the latest album with. It is my trusty old Tama Star Classic Performer BB drum kit. BB stands for Birch and Bubinga Wood, which this drum set is made out of. I've had this set since 2007. It was my very first real drum set that I bought when I was about 17. And it served me very well ever since I bought it. And I have recorded multiple projects and songs for various clients all over the world with this drum set. And it never disappointed me once. So, currently the set is equipped with Evans G2 clear heads on the better side of the toms. And by the way, these are 10 inch, 12 inch, 14 inch and 16 inch toms. And as you can see, the set is, equ is also equipped with a number of different minor symbols. Starting from the left, we have a Minel Soundcaster Fusion 16 inch medium crunch, followed by a 10 inch Byzant splash, followed by a 14 inch MB20 heavy sound wave hi hat. Next, we've got a 16 inch Byzant thin crash, a 10 inch Soundcaster Fusion, let's see, a 10 inch splash Soundcaster Fusion. Here we have an MB20 17 inch heavy crash followed by a 17-inch Byzance Thin Crash. Here we have the Derek Roddy signature model. It's the Byzance 21-inch Serpent's Ride. The bell is awesome on this symbol. And last but not least, we have a Byzance 18-inch Dual China. Most importantly, the set is equipped with my newest addition, the Chachi Copito Double Pedal, which is just awesome to play. I recently have become a, a member of their artist roster, which I'm very proud of. And these pedals, they are just killer. Alright, that is the setup that we're going to use. But before we can start tracking, we need to change the drum heads on the snare and the toms. Let's do that now. 